back. Today I'm in Notting Hill and I'm going to take you around to show you five of my favorite places to get sweet treats while you're here in London on Portobello Road. There's a ton of food stalls to choose from, but things like this cinnamon roll are going to be what really, really make your trip to Portobello Road extra special. And I, I think it's like cardamom and orange or something. I don't know. So tasty though. So good. probably seen if you have followed for any time because I used to come here all the time with Viola and we'd get little snacks in the afternoon when it was cold um, and I use them for a lot of parties I've been at my baby showers Christmas parties whatever they're really crunchy so if you like softer ones these aren't for you but for like sweet parties you're gonna want to go here and I like to just go get coffee here so all right come on actually been to Portobello before you're wondering where is everybody well I'm here on a random Monday and it's in January and it's rainy it's the day to come if you have the place to yourself gone into Gail's. Um, Gail's has a really good hot drink so if you're a coffee snob and you like pastries it's gonna be your winner. It is a chain so you'll find locations of them all over London like maybe there's eight or nine of them. But they're really good. The food's super good and it makes you feel healthy if you have an almond croissant if it's from Gail's for some reason. Right. Hummingbird. Red velvet cupcakes are legendary and they are delicious but I say if you're gonna go for like 20p more get a slice of cake because it's massive and you can share it. It's a little bit cheaper or eat it all to yourself and it's only 20p more. Either way and you've just still ordered one thing. So yeah, Hummingbird, pretty legendary. It's kind of like the Magnolia Bakery of London. It's really good, really good. I'm gonna keep walking though because I just had that last week as you might have seen in my vlog for our 11th anniversary. All right, last stop. It wouldn't be a complete bakery tour of Notting Hill if I didn't take you by. Yodo Modalangi's Jewel in the Notting Hill Crown Odolangi. I mean, savory, sweet, whatever you want. This is a must. pretzels which is my favorite but the almond croissants are also pretty amazing I just could do it today after that cinnamon roll but anyways I hope you enjoyed that those are the five bakeries that I love the very most here in Notting Hill and I think most people that live in Notting Hill would agree those are the creme de la creme or the cookie de la cookie or whatever people say about really really amazing baked goods those are those so enjoy your trip to Notting Hill I hope this was helpful and travel well and eat often bye guys <laughs>